Hi, I'm going to show you how to make this bracelet. First, we're going to lay red rubber bands forward on both sides all the way to the end. Now I will show you how to lay the rubber bands onto the template. Be sure to continue this until the end and do this on the other side as well. It should look like this when you're done. Now we are going to lay the diamond pattern rubber bands onto the template. You can alternate the colors from blue to white or yellow and continue this until the end. Again, we're going to start with the side where the arrows are pointing forward. Since I don't have blue and white, I'm going to use pink and purple instead. I'm going to start with purple rubber bands, then pink rubber bands, then purple rubber bands again, then pink. Can you continue this to the end? This is what it should look like when it's done. Flip the template over so that the arrows are pointing towards you. An easy way to hook the rubber bands is to hold the hook where the pointy side is facing away from you. I'll start from the bottom row and hook the red rubber bands forward. Make sure to push it down so that's easier. Now we're going to this pin and we are going to pick up the pink rubber band and hook it this way and pick up the other pink rubber band and hook it that way. Now go to the next row and hook the purple rubber band going inwards like this and hook the other purple rubber band and hook it inwards like that again. Now we're going to get the red rubber band again and hook it forward. Then grab this red rubber band and hook it forward as well. <clears throat> Then hook the pink rubber band going outwards like this. And hook the other side as well. Then hook the purple rubber bands like that. Keep on doing this until the end. This is what it should look like when it's done. Remove the last two rubber bands on this pin. Like so. Now we're going to put these rubber bands on two that pin, this pin right here, and these rubber bands onto this pin. You can remove this part too, so it should look like this. Stick your hook in and grab the rubber band and pull it up so it should look like this. Now it's time to pull it out, so just pull it out. This is what it should look like. Since this is not long enough, we're going to extend it. Start from a side where the arrows are pointing up, then just lay it until the end.
flip the template over and put this in and start hooking. Continue this until the end. Put the C-clip in the last rubber band, then pull it out. Join the other end so it looks like this. Thanks for watching our video. Hope you like it. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye.